We're starting tonight with an update to the wild story that a lot of people are talking about. The man who shot and killed a robber will not face any charges, at least not right now. Fox 26's Matthew Seedorf joining us live from HBD headquarters downtown with the new information in this case. Matthew. Yeah, Jonathan, that man met with Houston police today. They're not arresting him or charging him, but that could still change. New details involving this dramatic shooting inside a Houston restaurant. Police now identifying the would-be robber as 30-year-old Eric Eugene Washington. Late Thursday night, Eric barged into this taqueria off South Gessner, wearing all black, a ski mask and gloves, demanding money from customers while holding what police would later call a fake plastic gun. Then this man taking action, shooting Eric eight times as he heads to the door. Then once more, while on the ground, killing him. Thank God no one else was hurt. The restaurant owner and workers calling this man a hero. Returning the stolen money to customers and leaving in an old pickup truck before police arrive. Just thankful for the man who helped me and I just wanted him to take care of himself. Online records reveal Eric had been out of jail on bond during the attempted robbery. Recently charged with assaulting a family member, the 30-year-old also previously convicted for aggravated robbery with a deadly weapon, a case 10 years ago that resulted in the death of a 62-year-old Houston man. Police Monday meeting with the customer who fired these shots. So far choosing not to arrest him or charge him with a crime. Tonight, this incident is now being handed over to a grand jury. We're live downtown tonight. Matthew Seedorf, Fox 26 News.